got one. Oh, that was a great fish. <laughs> that was a freaking great fish. Oh, big and seen him eat it on the fall. Oh my God, big in dudes. Another big in. What is up dudes and welcome back to another exciting episode of Fishing on Road Doors. Once again, we are starting the vlog off in the truck on the way to the desired destination. I'm sure you guys can probably see it down below. Uh, we're fishing a new spillway today. Well, new to this year. I've definitely fished this spillway a lot. Uh, but I haven't fished here in like a year now, so yeah. We're heading to a spillway. Minnesota fishing opener was like three days ago, so yeah, we're pretty much just gonna tie on a paddle tail and try to crush. Stay tuned, dudes. Hopefully we can get some smallmouth, walleyes, I don't know, any anything that bites. All right, dudes. Just need to grab my net. The dam's looking really good. Like, really good. The current's looking pretty ideal this is looking fire oh man honeysuckles a little early for these guys eh oh that was a good one okay get myself a little station here and I am already rigged up dudes I'm going to start fishing actually at the dam get this net a little closer to me and yeah stay tuned there is crawfish everywhere I should probably have a craw I think I might have some in my truck but we're gonna give this a try first a little six cents paddle tail and I got just a little custom jig head from one of my buddies shout out Matt from Colorado okay Let's get on this rock here and usually I kind of cast net there's a big fish right there what is that a carp I think those are carp there's fish everywhere dudes smallmouth big smallmouth right there watch this oh my god oh my god dudes I can literally see fish everywhere. I honestly can't believe. There's one. I was just about to say, I can't believe I haven't caught one yet. I paused it and we got a small mouth. Oh, gonna be a good day. <laughs> it's looking like a pretty good one. Oh my God, let me loosen my drag a little bit. Get my net. Let's bring them down here so, so that we don't scare any of the other fish. Come on, dudes. That is a beautiful smallmouth. Let's go ahead, get this guy. This fish is so fat and tall for how, how short it is. Okay, look at that freaking stud. Oh my god like good lord look at how fat and stocky this fish is dudes that is insane took like 30 seconds 40 seconds to catch my first fish and that is an awesome fish to start her i am blown away let's go ahead get an awesome graceful release <laughs> thanks for the ride buddy he's just chilling there he goes okay well that took under a minute Let's try to do it again. Fish on. Perfect cast. Got one. Better. Good and. Oh. oh, maybe it's not better. It's looking like almost the same size. Probably not as fat though. I really don't think they get as fat as that last one. Okay. This guy's ready to come in already. I am so fired up that the smallmouth are in here. This is awesome. And I definitely don't think we need to show the big camera. That one, that was only like a two pounder. Let's, uh, I need to fix my plastic already. I'm gonna fix my plastic. We'll get right back to it, y'all. Oh my God, they're loaded up. Got one instantly, I missed them. Got a good one. Best one yet. This one's huge. 
Holy crap. This one's huge. This one's big. Like this is big. It's a five pounder. Five pounder, dudes. Oh, come on, buddy. Stay pinned. Oh my God, it's a Mondo. It's a Mondo. It actually is like a five pounder. Holy crap. Come here, bud. Come here, bud. Come here. I got him. <laughs> dudes, this is our toad. Oh my God, I can't even get him unhooked. Dudes, are you freaking kidding me? That is an absolute giant. Okay, there's a boat coming. I'm gonna try my best to just let him go quick. Okay, that was amazing. Let's try to do that again. So the reason I'm fishing this little wall right here over and, look at instant. There's a big one right there. The reason I'm fishing this just over and over, these fish are just coming up here literally all day, just coming and cruising right next to this wall. And I'm basically just waiting for the perfect current. The current changes, oh, I gotta fix my jig. The current is constantly changing, so you're just kind of waiting for that current to kind of sweep it into the right here. And when that happens, it kind of pushes your jig. God, there's a giant right there. It pushes your jig perfect right next to this wall, and then the fish are kind of able to eat it a little bit easier. Can you see these fish right here? But yeah, just in case you're wondering why I'm just casting over and over, just 10 feet right here, that's why. Just waiting for that perfect current. Oh, just waiting for that perfect current to let my to allow my jig to go right into one's mouth got one missed one got one nice nice just vertical jigging it you know you know how we do come here bud and shabang another beautiful little small mouth. This one might be a little bit bigger than that second one we caught, but still an awesome small mouth to catch on the river. Get a graceful release on him. Oh, big and seen him eat it on the fall. Oh my God. Big and dudes. Another big and first small mouth trip of the year. And we're crushing them. Fish number five. Where's my net? Come to daddy. Got him. That one was probably the coolest bite we've had yet. I literally, right when it hit the water, I watched him just pop out of just the black, deepest part of that little hole. And he smashed it. Let's go. Fish number five. And it's another good one. Jump over to this rock. Graceful, 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 graceful. seen him eat it too it's so cool you can see him eat it you just see your freaking paddle tail disappear that took a minute <laughs> another good one this one's definitely a little bit smaller we'll let him go right away Let's get back in there I just missed one. Or it missed me. Here's a big one. Big one. Got him. This ain't this is a different fish. This ain't a big one. I seen a big one going for it. And this one ate it first. Alright, there we go. Another one bites dust. Oh my god, I had him for a freaking solid five seconds. I didn't even set the hook. There we go. He bit it again. This one's pretty small. I'm just gonna flip them. It's almost like they're getting smaller or something. Yeah, they kind of are. Dude, I just took off my chesty. I was about to end my video. And I was like, you know what? Let's make one more cast. <laughs> There's like another four pounder. <laughs> Bye, buddy. All right, dudes. I think on that note, I think we are going to 
I think we're gonna get out of here. But holy crap, I am absolutely blown away. I cannot believe how many small malls are hanging out in that little thing. I missed like 20 fish too. Anyways, hope you guys enjoyed. Let me know down the down in the comments if you want me to come back here and do this again. There's usually decent walleye fishing here too sometimes. Not right now though. And I also want to come and make a bottom fishing video here soon because I've never done it. I always come here and just either walleye fish or crappie fish or smallmouth fish. I never try to catch like carp or suckers or catfish. There's catfish here. So yeah, I definitely think I'm gonna come back here soon and do that. But yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed the smallmouth today. If y'all could like this video, share this video, smash that subscribe button, and I guess all that's left to say dudes, you guys start fishing more. We'll see you next time.